Phillips 66 presents Big 12 basketball tonight from Morgantown. The Mountaineers of West Virginia hosting the Baylor Bears. Lob inside, Austin gives it up. Heslip. And Heslip buries a two-pointer to get Baylor on the board. Kalichla, no real threat to shoot out there. He hasn't taken a three all year. Harris, he does take the three and buries it. Staten can't get it to go. Fight for the rebound. Kalichla handles it this time. Wow! Heslip clears the glass. And even though West Virginia did not score in that last transition basket, I love the up-and-down pace trying to manufacture points. Too. How about that alley-oop from Jackson to Austin? With Stephen Howard, I'm Dave Armstrong watching Isaiah Austin go crazy, not just in scoring, but now with a great assist to Corey Jefferson. Baylor right now with their biggest lead of the game. Austin, now a three, come on. Oh my, what more can this guy do for you? Well, he picks it off here. Here comes Heslip on a three on two break. Rose has got it. Back to Austin. It was falling out of his hand and he still made it. First points for Baylor in almost five minutes of this game. Now Henderson, a three. Jackson pulls up a three-pointer. Got it. Pierre Jackson. And a pickoff. A.J. Walton, who had three fouls in the first half, had to sit behind the back to Pierre Jackson. On your heels, you tend to play the whole game on your heels, and that's what I'm seeing thus far in this game. Good move by Jawan Staten. Mixed himself up just a little bit. Harris, good ball fake. Count the basket. Corey Jefferson's now on the bench. Okay. Oh, look at that give and go. And Walton gets behind the defense, and no one came over to help out for West Virginia. That's aggressiveness on both sides. Walton. Nice move. Boy, A.J. Walton's all of a sudden taken over offensively, and Baylor back within one. Gary Franklin in the second half, because if Haslip is not hitting jumpers, he really has nothing for Baylor on that basketball team. Mm -hmm. You see him knocking down a three. He can shoot just as well. Nine and a half minutes. Both teams fighting for postseason aspirations. Austin left open for three, and he nails it. That's off no good. Austin. Boy, great offensive rebound and stick back by Isaiah Austin. Let's see if the athleticism of Deuce Bello, who has the most athleticism on that team, can hinder Ian Harris. But Noreen steps up. Huge three. Just like he did at Texas. Oh, way too much time. Now you have to go for a three. Staten does. That's way off target. In fact, partially blocked. And Baylor's coming out of Morgantown with a victory. So the Baylor Bears with a huge win on the road. Despite not getting a field goal in the last seven minutes of the contest, the Bears come back and win it.